Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. Thank you for our time together. Every time we sing that song, Water, and the dance water is ministered in our church, all I think about is how Jesus prepared the hearts of the Samaritans. You see, the Jews had a saying in the Talmud, thank God I was not born a dog, a woman, or a Samaritan. They hated the Samaritans. These were the people of the divided kingdom. These were the people that had followed Jeroboam. They were not even considered true Jews. They were half-breeds. They were mestiza. And the, the prejudice against them was legendary in the heart of the Jewish people. They wouldn't even speak to a Samaritan. And Jesus sat down with that woman at the well and spent several days and an entire village came to Jesus that day. Now, look at the seed that was sown. Acts 8, beginning with verse 4. Now there were those scattered. They went about preaching the word. Philip went down to the city of Samaria and proclaimed to them the Christ. And the crowds with one accord paid attention to what was being said by Philip. And when they heard him and saw the signs he did. Now, brothers and sisters, a great revival broke out in Samaria. Yes, Philip was the instrument. But the seed had been sown by Jesus in that Samaritan village years before. That seed had been sown by Jesus as he spent time with an entire village and he showed people that as the Christ, he loved everybody. Now when Philip goes down there and begins to preach about this man that they had heard about, an entire city comes to Christ and a great revival breaks out. Now here's the lesson I want you to see. Many of you are seed sowers. You go into the province. You share with your families. You show them how God breaks down the walls of prejudice. You open your heart to people. People come to Christ. And, and there's a small move of God, just like Jesus with the woman at the well that day. There's, there's a small move of God. and A small number of people are saved, maybe a barrio. But as they begin to talk, later a crusade comes into town. And a huge harvest of souls takes place. But it all started with a seed that was sown. Some of you, you do the crusades. Some of you, you're like Jesus with the woman at the well. You're sowing the seed that later will burst into full revival. 